Hello everyone, this is Onistops and you're watching Electric Box by Twinkle Star Games. Actually, you're watching a gameplay of Electric Box by Twinkle Star Games played by me, yours truly, Onistops. And I have a feeling I'm clipping out a little from the bottom. Anyway, um, let's play uh, Electric Box. It's a puzzle. It's a really short puzzle, uh, but there are extra custom levels says so right there uh, we're going to read that after we're done hopefully I can squeeze it into one video and hopefully the bottom part is not being clipped I don't think so okay moving on Robin Hood yeah there's a button uh, it's right there anyway I hate ads come on mochi visit candystand.com for the hottest games online okay, I'm guessing visit candystand.com because they are the hottest games online will probably burn out my graphics card uh, yeah Come on, spin. I want to show the game where we're gonna play Electric Box. Get electricity to reach the target. Let's play Electric Box by Twinkle Star Games. It says so right there. On new grounds. Uh, it's also on candy stand and where you can get the custom levels, right? By pressing uh, the enter code thingies to custom Electric Box levels. You can only access that in candystand.com. We can also create a level editor, in a, there's a level editor in there, more games takes you to candystand.com and credits, let's see the credits. Twinkle Star Games, Fun Tank, twinklestargames.com, music from Synthetic Synergy, Waves of Energy by Sidom, Record ZZZ, sounds from soundsnap.com. It's got some really kick-ass ambient rock type music, I'm not sure, I don't get the genre thingy of music. Anyway, let's play. I played it up to level 6 something, it cost 15 levels, I hope I can finish it in this one video or I'll probably make two videos. I don't know, let's find out. Zero one. Oh, I uh, forgot to show, uh, get electricity to reach the target, that's the power, that's the target, we gotta get the power to the target, simple enough. Yeah, we can skip the tutorial here or, you know, I can read it. Welcome to electric box, let's learn the basics of the game, let's do because basics are important. Next. This is the main power supply. Awesome. Next. And here is the target. We'll need to figure out how to get power from the main power supply to this target. Next. These metal words can be used to conduct electricity. Awesome. Because you know metals are conductors. Okay, let's power up the source and see what happens. You click the source to power it. Looks like it's supplying electrical current to the wire connected to it. Oh, you can totally see it. Unlike in real life where you can't. But you can get hurt. So never touch open wires. But we'll need to figure out how to get the electrical current over to the target. Which is this. So next. So let's figure out how to do that. First you'll need to turn the power off. Because clearly you can't handle a metal, metal conductor while it's on. Because otherwise you know. Adios amigos. Okay. Light and a solar panel. Let's take a look at our inventory components panel. Component panel. Two components are present. Drag and place the light anywhere on this wire. This will connect it to the power source. Let's take the light. Mini, 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 more. This is the place I choose or something like that. Whatever. Good job. Now turn the power on and examine the function of the light. The bulb is now producing light. Light from this type of bulb always travels in four directions. Left, right, down and up or whatever the light is normally the the light is normally is not visible yep Elric will love this <laughs> anyway but for the clarity of this tutorial the path of the light is represented with arrows it's one of the is should not be there okay it doesn't matter which one just one of them should not be there anyway if you don't know who Elric is you're going to have to go to my profile to go to his profile which is he is both under my friends and subscriptions whatever subscribers he's not my subscriber i'm a, his subscriber because he's awesome seriously he needs more subscribers damn it now let's figure out what to do with that solar panel once again you'll need to turn you'll need to first turn the power off okay the solar panel's main function is to catch light and then generate electric current right here you know as in real life drag and place the solar panel onto the wire connecting the target so that the light will reach the solar panel so you know we have to place it right here so that when the light is on 
it will reach the solar panel all right that doesn't happen in this kind of light so you have to place it here because you know unless you're you know stupid great job the setup looks complete switch the power source on yay boink yay it's working Whee! power up awesome time taken three minutes i am going to go over time oh yeah i'm going to go over time i, I don't care i'll make two videos no problem next level i need to uh, read those things you know i can hide help but remember you'll need to switch the power source off before rearranging any components as in real life there will be new components in each level you know like here on this level we've added a water dispenser and a water turbine don't forget that light travels in four directions left right up and down mouse over each component for an explain explanation of its function its explanation okay so we've got a light bulb just add electricity to produce light light travels straight in all four directions solar panel very effective for catching light and producing electric power water dispenser give it some power and it will release its water from the tank awesome water turbine the water turbine rotates with the flow of water and generates electric power so you know we can do this a lot of when but let's put it here so the light will oh sorry wrong way uh, that's the target sorry um, that's the source so it will power the light light will shine here electricity will be generated in this wire also called bus bar in electrical engineering will place the water dispenser here when it's got some power it will release the water which will turn the water turbine and it will generate electric power so let's see how it goes um in case you don't know which you probably don't i am studying electrical engineering bachelor's degree and i've just finished my third year examination and there are four years for to get my bachelor's degree and so this is a really fun game for me you know electric box it's related to my field whatever let's go next level just click on a component don't drag to alter its direction so like some components i'll show you some components have a fixed directions and cannot be altered so uh, um what's my accent hint place the fan right here facing rightwards okay that's the fan see it says produces air air is not visible and always flows either rightwards or leftwards remember air can be used to push Team. see clicking it changes the direction so let's facing rightwards steam from the kettle always rises upwards or kettle as whatever you like to say air from the fan blows either rightwards or leftwards click the fan to change its direction and don't forget that air can push steam there it is so we've got electric kettle is here very useful for making tea but in this case you'll only need the steam steam is very light and always rises upwards of course Steam detector. Give it some steam, and in return, it will produce electric power. Windmill. Give the blade some air to rotate, and it will generate electric power from its base. So, there's the source. So, just as you can see, that's the mains power supply. Provides an unlimited amount of power that would be epic in real life. Switch it on to generate power. Switch it off again before rearranging any components. Okay. So, it will heat the steam, and let's just show you how the steam rises. See, steam does not rise exactly vertically. It rises one block to whichever it's facing that direction. So let's turn it off. So we're going to put a steam detector there. It's going to start the wind. This is the windmill. The wind is going to hit here. Charge this line. Charge this bus bar or bar as you like to call it. We're going to put one here and one here. Oh, one second it rises straight it doesn't rise straight up then it will rise this way so we change the direction then it will rise this way so we'll just put it there and then it will rise there there is a problem in that circuit you're going to find out what but let's just see i like the sequence of events it's kind of fun hopefully the sound is good and yeah um, see the wind is there it's going to push the steam away so let's turn it off put it here then it will rise here wind will push it here and well we'll see
Yay, the tea is ready, master. Will you have biscuits today? Will you? Will you? No, I'll have uh, atom like whatever, 256. Good. 